Hello and welcome. In this video we'll be showing you how to wire a PWM4 Kasambi controller. Our first step is to connect a driver to the controller. Be sure to use a driver with a 12 to 24 volt output. Insert the red wire into the positive and tighten down. Now insert the black wire into the negative. Now that you've connected your driver, it's time to connect your LED strip. This is a 4-channel controller, which means that it can take plain white, tunable white, RGB, and RGBW LED strips. When using a white LED strip, put your power wire into the positive, and use channel 1 for the second wire. For tunable white, use the positive channel for the power wire, channel 1 for the warm light wire and channel 2 for the white light. For RGB, put your red, green and blue wires into channels 1, 2 and 3, in the order of the acronym. For RGBW, do the same, and insert the white wire into channel 4. In this video we're connecting an RGBW strip. Simply insert the wires into the correct channels, and tighten down. Now you can connect your driver to a power source. To learn how to control your LEDs from your smartphone in the Kasambi app, check out our videos titled, Creating a Network, and Pairing a Device. Here at Wired for Signs USA, we offer a few variations of the PWM4, to suit the needs of various situations. The UL listed version is identical to the model used in this video, except that it has a max output of 96 watts, instead of 144. We also offer this waterproof version, with a 144 watt output. And finally for heavier loads, we offer this variation. It has a 480 watt output. Thanks for watching. We hope that this video was helpful, and we look forward to creating more videos like this in the future.